for thou art with me. The Holy Ghost has told me to give you prophetic permission to turn your Y-E-A into a Y-A-Y. You didn't hear what I just said? Turn your yet into a yet. Now, Y-E-A, yet, means even though. But Y-A-Y says, I'm celebrating. Okay, I'm through, I'm through, I'm through. I'm in cheerleading mode right now. Somebody say, yet, though I walk. Yet, I'm celebrating the fact that even in the midst of my darkness and my distress and my depression and my distress, I will fear no evil. And my son Hoop right here, from how hard with me. And because he with you, because he made it through, I need to tell somebody you too can make it through. I know you kind of keep right now. You don't want nobody to know you're taking value. I know you kind of keep right now. You don't want nobody to know your child is about to worry you to death. You, you kind of keep right now. But I need to reach over and touch somebody and tell them that the Lord he will carry you through because he brought you to it in order to walk you through it. Notice something I'm through. Notice that this test, notice that this distress, it did not manifest itself until the ninth hour. Oh, I feel preaching, y'all. Jesus only hung on the cross from the sixth to the ninth hour. But he held out, he dealt with it, and waited until the ninth hour. Until the pressure got so bad on him that he had to holler out, my God, my God, why has thou? Now, now can, can I give you, can I give you a revelation? He waited until the ninth hour. He waited until the last hour. He waited until it was almost over. Would you reach over and touch your neighbor and say, neighbor, if you just hold out, if you just hold on, it's almost over. Because before I close, I need to tell somebody who's dealing with the pain and the torture of mental and emotional anguish. And you just about to give.